welcome to Ohio Valley Couponer. Today is Saturday, December the 9th of 2023. I'm coming to you guys with Vlogmas day number 10. I cannot believe we've been doing Vlogmas for 10 days. Hopefully you all have been enjoying it so far. Oh, uh, it is starting to rain. No fun, because I got to go to like several different places. So yeah, but I'm out and about right now doing some Christmas shopping. I told you all on a video last couple days, I think it went up on Thursday, that I'm doing this thing through my dad's work is adopt a senior program. It's really a great thing. It's a lot like Angel Tree just for seniors, which is really nice because I feel like a lot of times seniors can be forgotten during the holidays and, you know, they can all use Christmas cheer too. And they have, you know, gifts and, you know, needs that people can help supply, you know, during the holiday season. And so I'm really excited to be doing this again this year. So I'm out doing shopping for the person I got and actually pretty straightforward list so she wanted some like beads and crafting supplies. So like coloring books and beads to make crafts. Pretty easy. I'm here at Dollar Tree. They have tons of crafts and for $1.25, pretty good. So I'm going to go ahead and get her a variety of things here. And then she wants an electric pencil sharpener. Again, pretty easy. It's like not even $5. And then she requested a new nightgown. So that is what I am doing. I also want to give her some hygiene products out of my stockpile because everybody can use those. So I'll throw some of those in there and it'll be a great gift and help make her have a better Christmas, I hope. So anyways, guys, let's get on in here to Dollar Tree. Let's not get too wet in the rain. I don't know what is going on, guys. It has been in the 50s in Ohio, and even it was in the 60s yesterday. It's insane. But you really can't enjoy it that much because then it rains like this, like more than half of the days of the nice temperature. So, boo. Guys, I don't think I've ever seen Dollar Tree quite this busy. It's pretty nuts. So she didn't say specifically like what beads she wants, like sizes or things like that. So I'm just going to get an assortment of different beads that they have. So I found these like little sets of different pink beads. So I figured those would be good. There's six of them there for $1.25. That's pretty great. We also have this big pack of 260 beads for $1.25 for all those. That's pretty good. So I'm going to get her these. And then I also found her some of these beads. I'm trying to decide which ones I want to get her. We already got her a lot of pink, so we'll go ahead and pass on those. These are kind of different colors than what I already picked up, so I'll go ahead and give her those. And then, uh, these look nice. I'll just go ahead and get these two as well. So I don't know. I know nothing about beading. Hopefully, hopefully this is the kind of stuff she's wanting for beads. So here's hoping. They renovated my Dollar Tree a couple months ago and made it into like one of the Dollar Tree Plus where they have Beyond Dollar Twenty Five stuff. And now I can like barely find anything in here since they moved everything around annoying so i did check and she specifically does want kids coloring books not the adult coloring books so i feel like she'd like these precious moments ones so they have like pets and then safari pets so that might be good for her so yeah now i gotta find a line that doesn't have like 500 people in it i think every single line's open and every single one of them are full so this might take a while. All right, guys, we are all done at the lovely Dollar Tree. Got the coloring books and the beads. That was pretty good. It's like I got her a good assortment of crafting items. So that was good. Lots of stuff and projects for her to work on. But now I'm going to head over to Kohl's, I think. It's right here. I'm going to brave Kohl's. It looks pretty crazy in there. Now, Dollar Tree, I will say, it was crazy busy. But they did get us in and out pretty quick. Like, I got to, you know, I waited in line for a little bit. But I was checked out in like under 10 minutes. So they were moving that pretty quick. So that was good. Um, so maybe Kohl's will be the same way. Maybe it'll be the same way. So we're going to head into Kohl's, see about the nightgown. I do have a coupon. So that will be good. If I don't find one here, I could go to JCPenney as well. Because I have a coupon for JCPenney. So I got coupons for a lot of places right now, which is really nice. So that's a good part about the holidays. Is they have a bunch of coupons. So yeah, going to head on into Kohl's and see if I can find a nightgown. Oh my goodness, guys, this is looking pretty crazy at Kohl's. I'm scared. I don't exactly love shopping at Kohl's on a normal day. So at Christmas, even worse. Oh my goodness, guys, look at this. That's the line to get to the registers. Like, it's literally worse than Black Friday. Like, wow, it's pretty crazy. Like, I came here on Black Friday. It was less busy than it is today. I'm going to be real. I kind of have no idea what I'm doing. I mean, I'm sleepwear. Yeah, it should be in sleepwear, but yeah, it should be really interesting. All right, so leaving Kohl's, I lost my car because that's what I do all the time. Leaving Kohl's, I did not end up getting any there because they only had a couple and they were short sleeve, lightweight ones. I was wanting to get her like a long sleeve, more warmer one for winter. So I saw some stuff on jcp.com that looked like they had some more like wintry ones but it didn't tell me if they had 2X in stock, so I don't know. 
JC Penney's just literally right down the street. So I'm gonna check there, see if I can find a better one. If not, I know Coles did have the like lighter weight short sleeve one. So if that's like what we have to get, that's what we have to get. But I'd like to try to find her a warmer one, you know, since it's winter. So yeah, that is what I'm gonna do. And plus it was crazy busy in there. So if I can find one at JC Penney and not have to wait in a line that like goes around the store, that would be, that would be nice. So let's go to JC Penney. Oh my goodness, guys. JC Penney looks packed too. So this should be, this should be fun. I will say everybody's holiday spirit this year has been top notch. It's been so great. All right, so I feel so out of my element. Like guys, this is just so much. They do have nightgowns. They do have quite a few nightgowns. Now this, this might be good. It's a flannel one. Guys, JC Penney came through. I'm so excited. So they have the 2XL and it's long sleeve. It's flannel. So it's all nice and warm. This is perfect. And it's on sale for cheaper than Kohl's. And it's even better because I have a coupon 50% off at JC Penney. So awesome. This is going to be under 15 bucks. This is great. So I wish I just would have came to JC Penney first. Their selection's better. So yeah, gonna get this. Guys, it didn't even take like five minutes to check out. That was awesome. So I came into the Joann's in our mall because they're going out of business just to see what they still had left, what their discounts were. I really love these Aaron Condren markers, but I think they're only 40% off. And I got a better deal than that on Black Friday. So nada, not happening. Man, guys, the mall is nuts. So I am happy to be out of there but I got the nightgown and didn't get anything at Joann's. That is still too expensive for me. They just took more discounts, but no, still too expensive. I'm waiting for bigger discounts before I buy anything at Joann because yeah, I mean, I used to be able to get better deals than that. I mean, for real at a minimum, Joann's had a 40% off of any item coupon like almost every day. If it wasn't 50%, it normally was 40% and they had better sales than that. So like liquidations until the end, it's really a scam. So. Didn't buy anything there, but now we are here at the lovely Walmart. Gonna head in, finish up. I'm gonna get the pencil sharp. But yeah, I'm gonna do that. I think I'm gonna pick her up a pack of crayons too to go along with her coloring books. And those should be pretty inexpensive here as well. So anyways, gonna head into Walmart and finish this up. Check this out. Walmart did have some nightgowns, but not the right size. And they were $16.98. So I did really good at JCPenney. Honestly, I don't know about you guys, but I feel like Walmart's clothes have gotten so expensive. <laughs> a lot of times I can get better deals at other stores. I mean, with the exception of like their t-shirts that are pretty cheap, but like a lot of their clothes, like hoodies and various things, pretty pricey anymore. All right, with the exception of a few hygiene things when give her from the stockpile, I got her stuff done. So got this battery operated pencil sharpener. This is $4.97 or $4.98. And then I got some Krazar crayons. I wish I would've got these during back to school time, but I didn't know that I was gonna have somebody who wanted crayons, so I didn't pick any up while they were cheaper, but they're only 86 cents, so not too shabby. So anyways, pretty good. So I was in here, I decided to check about the Olay to see if they restocked, and I had false hope because this one was sitting right here. This is not the right one. They're still out of the nighttime Olay. Boo. I mean, one could dream, right? I am ready to be out of these stores. This is craziness. It's crazy busy today. It is so busy everywhere. Thankfully at Walmart, I did not have to wait to check out there. Like it was crazy busy, but they have so many registers open, you know, quick go through, get my stuff and out the door. So that was good. But I got the Christmas shopping all done for the senior, which is great. Like I said, just gonna get some hygiene items together at home for my stockpile, but that was really awesome. So yes, and I came in under budget. So that's even better, like yay. So awesome so i got that done and yeah glad to be down at the stores because it's crazy out here guys it's crazy out here it is later now it is 10 16 p.m so a little bit since i vlogged i'm actually on a different camera so hopefully this is all good i'm on my computer's webcam because my phone died and i put it on the charger downstairs so i was like i'm just gonna finish this on my webcam on my computer so hopefully this looks all right but if i'm not like directly making eye contact it's because the webcam's like way up there so yeah but anyways hopefully you guys enjoy following me along for more christmas shopping i got all the gifts for the senior which was great man it sure felt like like you know it's christmas you know it's christmas when the stores are crazy busy you can't typically find what you want on your first trip Oh my goodness, running around to Kohl's and then to JCPenney. Hey, at least it only took two stops. At least it only took two stops. That's not too shabby, but like, 
yeah, it definitely, you know, it's Christmas when the stores are crazy and all that fun. But, um, yeah, it's the holidays, right? It's the holiday season. So, yes, but I got all that stuff done. Um, we had a church thing today. Our church does, like, this Christmas concert they put on every year for the community. And they had a Saturday night, so we actually went to the Saturday night version. So, that was really good tonight. We went to that, um, and that was great. So, yeah, honestly, not a whole lot else to report today. Um, hope you guys enjoy me along for the holiday shopping. And yeah, thank you all so, so much for watching and come back tomorrow night for another vlog mess. They walk from house to house to wish us all a Merry Christmas Day. Oh, a Merry Christmas Day. Oh, 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 oh. we're chasing snow. Thanks.